Yo, what up, man? It's your boy Black Cheetah SA here, man. Yo, man, let me show you something, yo. You need to watch out. You need to watch out. Man, do this before you record your vocals. Do this before you record your vocals, like, in Cubase, in FL Studio, in any door that you use, man. You have to do this. It's a, it's a trick that, that will help you. Okay, let's go straight to the video. Then I'm going to show you. But first, subscribe to my channel. Ah, yeah. Man, before you record your vocals, you need to open up a, what do you call Visual DJ. You need to download and use this Visual DJ. Open your Visual DJ, man, and drag your beat to Visual DJ. Here, this is my beat. I drag my beat to Visual DJ. Okay. Immediately when you drop your beat to Visual DJ, your beat, uh, the Visual DJ will tell you the BPM of your beat, the tempo of your beat. So, as you can see, here is my BPM, 93. This is 93. Okay. It is the tempo BPM of my beat. Then after, you are going straight to your recording DAW. You are going straight to your Cubase, your FL Studio, your, your Pro Tools, whatever that you are using to record your vocals. Okay. You are going straight to it and direct the beat again. Or import the beat on your recording software. So this is my Cubase 5, man. So this is the same beat as you can see. Okay, before you do ev anything, after dragging or importing your beat on your recording software, you need to press Control T. This is Control T. I press Control T. So automatically, it's, it's going to, this, this will pop up on my Cubase. So you're going to click here. You see this orange thing. You're going to click this to activate the tempo setting this is the tempo let's go back to our our, our our visual dj okay 93 okay fine you're gonna activate your tempo here it must be white then you're gonna set 93 93 ha tempo is good the reason why you need to set up your tempo before you record it is it is very important guys your tempo like your vocals won't be late or it won't be early it will just be the way you want them to be it won't be one second late one second like early okay your vocals will be like the way you want it to be when you record your vocals you will go straight to the to the tempo and it will go along with the beat they will correspond it, it, they won't be late or early you, you feel me so you, you need to set up your tempo you know how to set to set up a tempo on fl studio you're gonna see it uh on a on a fl studio above there you're gonna see the tempo you're just gonna do the same thing if, uh, on your on your on your recording though and again the tempo will help you with the with the reverb, your reverb will hit correctly. Your delay, they will hit correctly. They will sound good, man. So this is the trick that I wanted to show you. BPM, guys, tempo. Set up your tempo. Because people have been asking me how to set up a tempo. Use the, the visual DJ. Use the visual DJ to check the tempo. Then you go to straight your recording door and set up your tempo before you record. Don't forget to subscribe. I'm going to see you on the next video, man. I'm going to see you on the next video. Then when you set up your tempo, then you're just going to record. Tempo recorded. Tempo recorded. Now we're good, yeah. Tempo recorded. Ah, tempo recorded. Tempo recorded. Tempo recorded. Ah, tempo recorded. Tag, 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 tag. As you can. Tempo recorded.
as you can see guys tempo recording ah tempo recording tempo recording tempo recording ah tempo recording tag the tag 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 my vocals are not like dot l they just go in straight to the tempo correction so yeah man don't forget to subscribe guys leave the suggestion on the comment section man support the boy like the video check the next video i'm coming up with more videos for you as long as you support the boy then you like and subscribe and comment like the video i'm with you guys my name is black cheetah essay ciao